Alright. <clears throat> All right, where is everybody? Are we here? I better mute that. All right, part 16. Part 16, part 16, here we go. I'm on commercials right now, so I don't know if I'm actually streaming or not, but... Uh, here we are. So we are. We are on part 16. I do believe I am up now. We're going to go play uh, Strangers and Freaks to start out today. And uh, I have no idea which one this is. I just know that I probably don't like it. But, uh... Okay, whatever that was. Um, okay. Let's go! So I know everybody's really excited today, right? Everybody's excited. You got an official, uh, well, I guess you can do an official countdown for the first trailer now for GTA 6. Everybody should be excited about that. Everybody's pumped. Uh, I don't know how many followers I have now or subscribers I have, but I'm going to tell you right now, if I get to 100,000 subscribers before that trailer launches, I'm going to do a playthrough. And uh, we'll put the trailer on during the playthrough. I got to figure out how to do it. But that's going to be an early morning playthrough, though, man. I'm going to have to get up at, like, 8 o'clock. I probably won't. I won't take a shower or anything. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do it Trevor style. I'll just, I'll just come in stanky and funky. What is this blue dot? Is this the chick that uh, Emergency. the gangster's dad or daughter? Can you please give me a ride? I can't do it. I can't marry him. Oh, no, Emergency. no. Jump on board. No, no, I'm not giving you a ride, sweetheart. We're Just we're get going. Out of here, please. I live in Vinewood Hills. Yeah, you I'm not going time. all the way back to Vinewood Hills. Oh, Sorry. Thank you so much. I was starting to think nobody was going to stop. Nobody they is going to stop. A wedding dress, and they assume crazy. I'm He's taking you. One, not me. I'm going to take you to. Uh... No, I couldn't go through with it. I'm not ready. Oh, just the thought of waking up next to that caveman every morning oh, for the rest of my life. Oh my God! I can't listen to this oh, chick. My God. All right. him. He's coming after me. Good. What the Get out of the car. What are you doing? That oh, finally. Now please take me home. I can't wait to get out of this stupid dress. What the hell's going on here? Why is that coming up? Anything for the bride on her special day. I should never have let it go this far. Oh man. Oh, what happened? My buttons got changed. He spent 10 grand just on ice sculptures for the reception. We had these cute the buttons got changed. What the hell happened? It was going to be so fabulous. This is aim. That's aim. Why did that change to load the... Uh-oh. Hang on, guys. I got to change my settings. I messed up my settings somehow. Uh, Gamepad. Where is... First person control type. Uh, weapon wheel. No, I don't want that to happen. What is... Alternate? No. Well, we don't care about that. Third person control type. Here we go. Standard. Boom. Very good. I must have hit that accidentally. Only there we go. Imagine. Now I can aim at you. Oh, God. But I, I can't I shoot you. Can I hit you? Anything to be rid of him. Oh my God. Am I stuck with me. this gal? What? I guess that's my something borrowed. What did you ever see in that guy? On paper, he was perfect. Rich, oh, this was this was a big mistake. This was a big was mistake. Nice to me sometimes after the rages, I thought I could take. Hey, where are you taking me? I'm taking oh, you elsewhere. Don't worry. Just think about that lucky escape you had back there. And he was nice to me sometimes after the rages. I thought I could change him. Are you married? Mm, no. If you can believe it, nobody snapped me up yet. And I know he did some hooker up. All right, where is the, uh, yeah, I got to go back there. Unbelievable. I can't believe I got to go back there. Uh, why did I pick this? Why did I pick this girl up? How did I get rid of her? Let me think. Ah, I know how to get rid of her. Okay. 
I know how to get rid of her. Party, but he just kept smiling and talking about his stupid bro pass. You know, he told me once that infidelity doesn't count out of state. Well, guess who's got the honeymoon tickets? Two can play at that game. I might even get pregnant. I'll have some Greek waiters, baby. See how he likes that. There was no way I was having kids with that Neanderthal. <laughs> I'm not going anywhere. She's still talking underwater. All right. All right, Trevor, get out. Swim off. <laughs> That's one way to get rid of her. Okay. I'm going to get in this boat right here. She's on her own now, unless she can get in a boat and ride with me. Dump her in the Alamo Sea. <laughs> Oh, that's cold, man. That is cold-hearted, Trevor. Trevor, you're a piece of shit. How could you do something like that to that nice girl? She's running after me. Hey, wait a minute. Is she swimming after me? Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Where's the blue dot? There's the blue dot. Is she is she swimming to get in the boat? Oh, if she's swimming to get in the boat, I'm taking her to Vinewood Hills. I I I, I have to. Where is she? There she is. Is she swimming away or is she swimming to get into the boat? I can't tell. Where the hell is she? Right there. Okay, come on, get in. Where are you? Right there. She's just swimming around. Is she going to get... Where are you going? I got to get up. I got to get up here. I got I to gotta stand up. Now, here she comes. Is she going to get in the boat or is she just going to keep swimming around? Oh, this is awesome. Oh, okay, go ahead. I didn't want to give you a ride anyway. I'll run your ass over in the boat, though. Where's the boat? Where's, where is she? Did she just die? Where's she? Oh, she got eaten by a... What? What the hell happened? Oh, she died. She died. How'd that happen? Throw a grenade at her. All right, whatever. All right, now I gotta find a car. All right, can I can I do my strangers and freaks thing now? That's one way to get off of her. <laughs> that was so cold-hearted, man. I can't believe I did that. Yes, I can. Oh my god. Now I can go to my strangers and freaks mission that I was going to. Uh, what? Excuse me, guys. Who are you honking at? Is that Nigel? No. Oh my god, look at these weirdos. That's something I never understood. Why does he say for fuck's sakes? It should be for fuck's sake. Why do people say for fuck's sake? S with, it, with plural. What is this? Hey, girls. Oh, this is going to be a... Uh, I think this is I think this is one of those uh mm, you're a little freak, aren't you? I think this is one of those rampage things. Let's go over and talk to these girls. Let's talk to this hooker. She's standing out on the freaking You make me want to emigrate. I got shit to do. Well, I bet you do. Oh, you really suck. All right, I'm going to tell you right now. I lived in the desert. Hey, asshole, there are no hookers in the desert that look that good. Okay? None. Not that I ever saw a hooker in the desert, but... Holy crap, these guys are levitating. They just levitated. Oh, she called the cops on me. Oh, my God. Now I got to do that? Oh, man. I'm going to run her ass. Oh, there's the cops. Okay, I got to ditch these guys. Then I'll come back and deal with those rednecks. Ditching them that way. Man, I'm having a hard time getting to this stranger and freaks deal, man. The hooker called the cops. What hooker is going to call the cops? That's what I want to know. Yeah, hi. This is, uh. This is Mirabelle. 
Yeah, yeah, no. The hooker? Yeah, you know me. Yeah, uh, this guy's hitting on me over here, and he just called me a bitch. And can you come arrest him? Yeah, no problem. We got that. Uh, attention all units. We have a 69 in progress. Female suspect said to be armed with two big bazookas. Please proceed with caution. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. All right, let's go. Let's get these guys now. Is she back? Is it the same one? No. All right. You're going to meet a bitch. That's where you're going to meet one. You know what I'm saying? Hey, hey. Give me a sip of that. What? Come on! My throat's dry as a motherfucker. Why? Is your mother dry when you're... <laughs> what the fuck is that, huh? Nothing. Well, it didn't sound like nothing. All right? It didn't seem like nothing. I don't think that it was nothing. I didn't mean nothing by it, old man. Old man? Old man! Old man! Oh, creepy old motherfucker. All right, he's about the rampage. Hey, Steven Yarnell, what's up? Creepy. Uh-oh. Oh, rampage time. Let's go. What, what, what? So sorry, where sorry, were we exactly, huh? Get up. Uh, sorry, man. We're sorry. Help. Help. There's a guy with a gun. And what? All right. All right, how many of these guys do I got to take out? Where are they? Nobody talks about my mother! Oh, hello. Where'd that come from? You want redneck? Oh, I'll give you redneck. All right, careful, Trevor. Careful, get in. Hide, hide, hide. Hide. All right, rampage those rednecks. Did I get enough headshots? Three headshots, 45 kills. I didn't get 45 kills. All right, so I only got, what, bronze on that? All right, whatever. That's good enough. That's good enough. All right, so that's that. that got rid of that stranger and freaks. Okay, so now I can do the rampages, which is fun. As Trevor. What's this other one here? Is this the... Is this the... Uh, let's look at this stranger and freak while I'm up here in the desert. I'm afraid this is going to be those uh, Border Patrol guys. I need a car. Let's take this one. Since mine's at the bottom of the Alamo Sea. Maybe I'll get lucky. Maybe this will be mod. I don't do much of the bounty hunting stuff, though. I, I've, I think probably in the bounty hunting thing, I've done maybe three in the entire time that I've been doing this deal. So, 
uh, and by this deal I don't mean uh, the live stream. I mean all the time that I've been playing the game. Uh, okay, so let's look at some of these while I got a second. Long have I waited for this moment. It's GTA 6, baby. Ghost Dog 814. Long have we all waited for this moment, my man. But this moment is really not a moment. Okay, I got to pause this. This moment is really not a moment, right? I mean, all they've done is is introduce the... Uh, is introduce the trailer. What is this? Oh, that's that was my dude who told me how to do something. All right. Uh, <clears throat> so... They've introduced the trailer. The trailer's coming on the 5th. I love people saying, oh, it's sad that I'm going to have to move on from GTA 5 now. And, you know, like that kind of stuff. Guys, the, the, the game's not coming out on the 5th, okay? The game's not coming out on the 5th. You got plenty of time to keep playing GTA 5. I know you don't want to. I know you want to get, get on to 6. But it's going to be a little while. It's going to be a little while. So stay patient. But at least Rockstar will keep feeding you stuff now, right? Because if... if if their uh, habits are anything uh, normal, like what they've done in the past, you know, you've probably got a good three, four, or five trailers before the game comes out. So we'll see. We'll see what happens. And you got, you know, DLCs on online and all that kind of stuff. So, you know, hey, Ned, can you give a shout out to my brother, Joel? Hey, Joel, what's happening, man? He's a big fan of yours. Love you, man, from Phase Beast. Okay, Phase Beast, your brother, Joel, just got a shout out. That is one crazy zombie chick. Yeah, yeah. Metal will never die is in the house, dude. Again. Uh, Kelly McDermott, she's in the house from somewhere where they have pounds. So you got to be in the UK somewhere, right? Or Europe or whatever. No, England. England has pounds. Is that right? I don't know who has pounds. But uh, hopefully Kelly McDermott doesn't have pounds. Uh, I'm trying to lose pounds. So... Actually, I don't really need to lose pounds. I just got to get my ass in shape. Uh, oh, look at this. Oh, cool. YouTube is inviting me back to premium. Man. Okay. Uh, <laughs> we will miss you. What? Wait, wait, wait. wait. Where is that? Wait, who, who just said they were going to miss me? Where, who is that? I got to ban that person. Uh, where is that? Hope all is well with the, with the fam. Gunnar Licious Breed TV. Everything is beautiful, buddy. Uh, the game sound is low. Somebody always says the game sound is low, but then everybody else says, oh, no, it sounds great. Sounds great. Which one is it? Is the game sound low or does it sound great? Got to be one or the other. Okay? Here. Let's go in here. Let's go to over here where it says game. Is that where I go for that? No. Uh, let's go to where it says settings, audio, anything on that music volumes where it needs to be special effects volumes where it needs to be. All right. No. Okay. So it's fine. The only thing I could possibly do would be turn up my speakers. I don't know if that affects game sound or not, but anyway, uh, Let's go here. Hey, Ned, I heard the trolls online. Really uncool. Yeah, yeah, Molly, that happens. That happens. It's not a big deal. Certainly not going to make it one. Uh, so anyway, what was I saying? Oh, I was saying about how you got time, man. You still got time. Nobody has to say goodbye to GTA V. Not yet, you know. In fact, nobody ever has to say goodbye to GTA I haven't said goodbye to GTA IV or GTA you know, or San Andreas or any of those things, you know, or Red Dead or, you know, that kind of stuff. So, you know, let's say goodbye. You come back, play it every once in a while. You know, you're going to complete the game. You're going to complete, complete GTA 6 seven or eight times. And then you're going to go, ah, oh, I want to go look at GTA 5 again. I miss Michael and Trevor and, so and Franklin. Man, this, this thing sounds like shit. All right, somebody tell me how the game sound is. Uh, fan Ned Luke, but I am not in jail, whatever that means.
Ah, Slim Shady's here. What up, Slim Shady? Big hug from Brazil. All right. Big fan from Portugal out there. Simão Lopez. Uh, Western Self, I'm doing great. Variant says hi. Expired mango. Expired mango. You don't want to eat a, a, an expired mango. Ned, love you. Say hi to my cousin. Hey, cousin. Cousin, let's go bowling. Damn, this truck is loud, man. That blew this truck up. There we go. Get out of there. Now let's go take this truck. You know, I just trashed it. I'll see it's put to use. Oh, that's better. That's better. Not so loud. What are the cops doing up here? <laughs> They're not playing, I'll tell you that. They just shot the hell out of those guys. Good work, officers. Cowblade. What's up? In Ireland, we use euros. Yes. I'll be coming to Ireland. I'll be coming to Ireland in the summer, I believe. I believe we'll be coming to Ireland in the summer. In a fine summer it will be. It'll be solo in me. Coming to the Dublin. Dublin Comic Con, whatever it's called. I believe. I don't have it in stone yet. Don't have it in stone yet, but we're hoping. Uh-oh. This is Maud. Okay. So, this is Maud, right? I love this chick. This this gal was so funny and, and dry. And her humor is, like, off the charts, man. And Steven had a great... Uh, Uh, relationship, you know, like like chemistry with the gal who played Maud. And I don't remember who who that was, but all I know is that she was great, man. She was a great. All right, so can you make your screen bigger? What, 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 what? Make my screen bigger? You mean of me? Of me personally? You mean this screen right here? If I make that bigger, I mean, what's more important, seeing me or seeing the game? Because seeing me to me is less important. Here, I can move this over a little bit. How you guys like my backdrop? Anybody recognize that place? Anyway, uh, all right, I'll do. I'll do that. Seif Mo. Seif Mo wants my wants my screen bigger, and I assume he's talking about, you know, my screen. Uh, okay. Seeing me is more important. I, I, really? Carlos Eduardo? You think that? That's the case? All right. Well, I'll leave it like that. I haven't figured out how to just put me there and not have have the background stuff or to make the background stuff at least transparent so you can see through it. I wonder if there's an opacity. Let me see something here. Let me go over here. Oh, man. I hope I don't mess up. I knew it. I knew it. I knew I was going to do that. Why did I do that? Why did I do that? I guess it was the fans. Get out of there. Now you only got half. Oh, there I am. I'm back. Okay, so, yeah. I, there's no way. I can't make this less... Op I can't make it more opaque or less opaque. But I can't make it see-through. So, stuff comes up there, you know, and I block it, and I need to see stuff. So, that's why I make me smaller, because... I don't, if you, honestly, I don't know if the female fans out there can handle all this hotness. So I got to keep it small, you know, because if I, if I blow me up big, you know, like this, I mean, we're, we're, we're liable to have a problem on our hands. You know, it's going to be, you know, I'm going to have like all, all these, these, you know, women fans just trying to claw through the screen to get to me. So I got to keep it kind of small. Yeah. Because <laughs> we got all this hotness working. <laughs> Big Daddy in the house. Okay. Uh, let's see here. Um, 
What am I doing here? Oh, I'm playing. That's right. Okay, let's go. Let's go visit Maud. Maud is awesome. I love Maud. Somewhere between Peachy and something. I forget, but I love her. Okay, I'm going to be quiet here because I love her. I want to hear this. It's a good cutscene, though. There you are, handsome. Hello, Maud. How have you been? Oh, simply wonderful. And you? About the same. Somewhere stuck between joyful and peachy. <laughs> Even in this world full of scum and detritus, it's only right that we all bear our share. Ain't that true? <laughs> Take this poor wretch on the run, desperate, alone, about to learn the true meaning of suffering, all for a few thousand bucks. <laughs> Think you can find him for me? Every man has his talents, Maud, and the rigorous administration of justice is, uh, is one of mine. That's why I love you, Trevor. I'll send you his file. Okay, <laughs> sure. Okay. Bye. Bye, Maud. You're awesome. All right. Uh, let's go. All right, so that's Maud. I love Maud. Maud's awesome. Somewhere between, what'd she say, vibrant and peachy? Bail bond missions now available. Director mode unlock, mod. So now I guess I can use mod in director mode. Problem is, I don't know what director mode is or how to use it and, you know, whatever. All right, so that's that's that with that. Let's see now. What do we got going on here? Does Trevor have any more jobs that he needs to do real quick? I don't think so. I think we're on to... Uh, Franklin's got two jobs. Let's see what those are. Have I ever visited Britain? SCO-19 CTSFO. Yes, we have. We actually went to the uh, MGM... Uh, All right, shit, it's time to go. MGM Comic Con or whatever it was uh, uh, in London a few years ago. It was great. Awesome. GTA 5 is your childhood. Baljeet Williams. Okay. Uh, let's see what's happening up here. Um, what do we got? Story mode is greater than online from AZ Dursley. Uh... I would I would agree with that. They're different though, you know. I mean, online's pretty online's pretty freaking fun. I have to admit, online online is uh, online's a gas, man. I, I love online, but you know, playing it on the PCs, you know, that's brutal. But on on you know on my PS5 or my Xbox, you know, Series X, one of those or any of them that I, I played it originally on on I think I played online originally on the the PS3 and 360, and then I and then I migrated my guys, you know, on the uh, to the Xbox One and the PS4, and then I migrated them to uh, Series X and PS5. But uh, PC, I've only had one guy. I didn't have to do any migrating or anything. So, you know, but mostly I play online on the PS5. Uh, hi, Ned. Hope you'll be in the last GTA 5 DLC upgrade. Update before GTA 6 drops. Respect from London, UK. All right, mate. I hope so, too. Uh, Bumblebee. That would be fun. Wouldn't it be nice? Wouldn't it be... Everybody go, oh, Ned's trolling us. Ned's trolling us. He's making... I I'm not trolling anybody. Somebody says, uh, I hope you're in this. And I say, wouldn't that be nice? And it's uh, confirmed. He's in it. He's in the next one. He's in the next one. I'm not going to tell you if I'm going to be in one, if I'm in the next one, or if I'm ever even going to be in one. You know why? Because you don't get to know. You don't get to know. You don't get to know until you see a trailer or something come out that says it. Until then, call it what you want. You can call it trolling. You could call it giving you info. You could call it well, whatever. You could call it eating popcorn. I don't care. All right. You're a living legend, man. God bless. I was shocked to find out your age. You don't, you don't anywhere near it. Thank you for making a game. We can all look back on fondly. Charles Smith. Charles Smith. 
What? Oh, you mean because I'm like an old fucker? You're, you're shocked? Because, again, all this hotness is just doesn't read? No. <laughs> Yeah, well, you know what? You're only as old as you feel, my man. You're only as old as you think you are. And, you know, I'm like 12. So I'm one of those 12 year olds on GTA Online <laughs> that everybody hates. That's me. Uh, if you get a thousand things every day, pal, make sure this is one of them. John Paul Carson or Colson from, uh, gotta be from somewhere over there. Uh, hey, Ned, I love all of, the, all of your work. I love what you do. Very happy for GTA 6 coming out. It's not coming out yet. It's just a trailer. I agree. I'm not saying bye of the old games. Also, may I ask you to call my friend, Blue, A.K. Adrian Short. Wait, Blue, your, your friend is Blue? That Adrian is your friend? That freaking midget is your friend? Unbelievable. All right. Well, Miles, you got to maybe check your friendships, bro. Then again, maybe not. I guess it's okay. Star. Oh, it's your birthday. Happy birthday, Star. I'm the person who sent the AI stuff on Insta. Hope you're cool with it. Have a nice stream. Do your best. Okay, Star. Thanks for the AI stuff on uh, Insta. Um, I'm not sure which AI stuff you sent because <laughs> we get a ton of it. But okay. Thank you. Uh, whole grain bread. A oh, whole grain bread's back. He was in there the other day or she. What's it like playing you in the game? Is it weird to play yourself since you did the lines of mocap? Uh, no, I love playing with myself. It's a lot of fun. Uh, James Emerson. What's up, bro? Welcome. He's in the house. Big Daddy's in. Let's see who else is in the house, man. Let's let's look around. How's that? Gaming's in the house. Big fan. I've seen you. Okay. Uh... Who else is in there? Is Ante Sabo? Moon Knight? Moon Knight? What's up from India? Holy crap. Gappy's here from Morocco. Can you say what? You kidnapped his wife. No, I won't say it. Because you know what? I'm going to play it. I'm going to play it in a couple seconds here. I'm going to find out what Franklin has. And then I'm going to change to Mikey. And then we're going to go. South African. The South African Mad Luke is there. Okay. What the fuck did he just say? Don't know. What did I just say, Revel? Hmm, there's Jenny. Jenny's in the house. Be careful. Okay, GTA or Red Dead? Come on, guys, really? Hey, Ned, love your work on the Trulicity commercial. <laughs> My body can still make its own insulin. Yes. You know what? Here, Okay, I'm going to tell you guys a little story about that insulin commercial that I did. So I go to... I go, to this thing you know you get to my age commercials and by the way commercials these days you used to be able to make a lot of money on commercials you know back in the day because they were all they were all union commercials sag after you know whatever now it, it, they're all non-union so i don't even do commercials anymore in fact my commercial agent dumped me because they can't get me seen because i'm i'm, I'm union you know and so these commercial guys are all they're all doing these non-union commercials now, which is probably why the commercials suck these days. But uh, the Trulicity commercial actually was a union commercial that I booked. They shot that thing in Madrid, okay? I went to Madrid for five days to shoot that thing, right? Put up five-star hotel. I'm not flexing, you know, but I'm just telling you this is what, what, what it was. I went in there for five days, five-star hotel, beautiful place, uh... I worked, literally, I went and did wardrobe, picked out the wardrobe, uh, begged them to let me wear I was wearing because everything else looked like crap. And then, so they let me wear that stuff. And then I went back to the hotel. That took about an hour. Then we went and shot the thing. It was like 104 degrees outside. And we shot this on this street corner with a building in the back, you know, so it kind of looked New York-y. And uh, I did the line a couple times, three times. The director goes, okay, that's it. We're good. Boom. Done. I worked for about an hour and 20 minutes in five days in Madrid. That's my story about Trulicity. And then it ran and they broke it off into a couple commercials and it ran for like a year and a half. So that was actually a really good spot. I actually liked that spot. I would have liked it more if I was the main guy, but the main guy was a girl, so it couldn't be me. <laughs> but you know what? You get paid the same. All right. So that's my Trulicity story. 
Let's see here. What are we looking for here? We're looking to see what oh, I got to get out of his house. I like Franklin looking like this, man. I think Franklin looks pretty cool like that. He's boss, man. Now you guys can say, oh, yeah, it is Ice Cube. All right, let me see here. What do we got? Oh, man. Paparazzi? Beverly? Again? Wait, 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 wait. Is this where I just show up and he's and he's like, you know, nothing? Yeah, okay, let's do the paparazzi one. That one's close. This is probably where I got to chase the car or something. So I better bring... I better ride my motorcycle. I think this is a motorcycle one. Although I think I ride somebody else's motorcycle, but let's find out. Nice wheelie, Franklin. So a lot of people don't know, real life, Solo, who plays Franklin, used to be a big motorcycle guy. He was, uh, like, he was, I think, president of a motorcycle club or something. But anyway, when last time I went out to L.A., or time before last, we went, uh, we were cruising in the hood. They had a huge motorcycle rally going on uh, down there in the hood. And so Solo goes, oh, we got to stop here. And I'm like, all right, man, let's get out. So we got out, and they were doing this huge, now I mean thousands of bikes, right? Just thousands of them. So we get out of the car. And it's like, yo, Solo, what up, bro? Hey, Solo. This dude is a freaking legend. And I'm not talking about Franklin. I'm talking about Sean Solo Fan freaking Tino, man. This dude is a legend. We go to the hood and everybody knows this guy. He, he's huge. He's like, he's just legendary. And it's not because he was Franklin. It's because he was Solo. And... He, it's just it's just amazing man and, and that's how a, a pasty white guy like me can go hang out in the hood and you know no problems whatsoever everybody knows so yeah this is my boy ned you know and all the kind of oh dude you're michael yeah cool you know and all that kind of shit so so it, it it's it's amazing man i mean he's just like he's just like uh he's a beast in the hood man it's just it's unbelievable everybody knows him so Let's go here and see what hey, Beverly's hey, up to. Here. You know what? If you thought it was incredible getting yourself that aging trap the other day, you just wait till we get a picture oh. of Bobby Mitchell getting in a dirt box, man. I probably got to cover this up, Good don't I? See you. No, seriously, dude. Dude, it is a backdoor bonanza with that bitch's concerned. Ah, yeah, I better be ready. America's I better be ready to cover up. this because I don't want to get. Cotton candy and puff. Yeah, ain't got I don't want to get. Uh, no, no, Eighteen. Dude. One shot at that dirty little slut monkey. We're in the money, homie. We're in the money. Uh, who <laughs> says America money? is going to hell? Well, not me. I... <laughs> Come on, let's move. Where are we going? Now, dude, this is a covert op. We need to blend in ninja style. Follow my lead. Confident but forget them. From here on out, we're ghosts. Yeah, me and you, we ain't gonna stand out. At all. Shh, the blow up cover. This should be fucking interesting. I can hear someone. Stay close and play it cool. What do you want me to do? I'm at work. Just play in this cipher. It's not that hard. <laughs> I don't care if it smells like number two. He's your grandfather. That's what family do. He's, He's your grandfather. Do your homework, okay? Hey, Maria. How it going? You know, another day, another minimum wage. <laughs> you see the paper from those lips? No, was it bad? Like a crime scene. Andrea said it was another animal party. Come on, they should be just past this pool. What's up? Anyone would think you didn't want to watch Poppy Mitchell getting pile drived. <gasps> They're right around this corner. Are you ready to see America's sweetheart getting in the sweet meat prayer room? Here, you take the camera. All right. She knows me. All right, I gotta do. I gotta do this. <laughs> Or is this happening? Uh oh. All right, take the picture. Is it good, babe? Oh, oh, it's fantastic. 
Record. Do I gotta record? Use R to point the camera. God dang it, come on. <laughs> I can't hide it! I'm trying to hide it. Let's do that. Maybe that'll work. Uh, aim. How do I take the picture? I'm just going to keep snapping stuff, doing... I think I need to, I think I need to blow the, the, the... I got to make myself bigger here. Why can't I make it bigger? Oh shit! Security! Abort! Abort! All right. This way! Come on! Go! 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 I will bankrupt you with legs. Hey! Don't drop that camera! Get the fuck in the car, man! <laughs> I can't see. In the car now! Uh oh! Get in! Get in! Shut up! I'm coming! I gotta keep myself from getting. Good. All right, I'm gonna have to skip that one. I may have to. I might have to edit that one out, which I not really know how to do. But let's exit. Uh, yes. So we got to remember not to do the Poppy Montgomery. Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah. Why can't I make it bigger? It's so chaotic, dude. Yeah, I know, Debbie. It's like very chaotic. It's chaotic in my life. You know, what am I going to do? Do you ever plan to play GTA 4? Because this is the most underrated GTA. I think it's the most overrated GTA, frankly. But, yeah, I've, I've played it. And uh, it was good. You know, I mean, I loved it. The story was much, much, much better. Uh, you know, it's a good story, dark. I don't think it was, it wasn't nearly as funny, which is what, I like GTA funny. I don't like GTA too serious. I got Red Dead for that, you know. I want funny, funny, funny. I th I'm, I'm hoping that, uh, what do you call it, is, is, I'm hoping that 6 is a laugh riot, and I think it's going to be, but. We'll see. Uh, let's see here. Uh, let's do this. Then we're going to go do a, a real case here. Uh, please, can we have Michael DeSanta online? As you wish, Timolay. Post L3 music. Hey, Ned, love your work on the Trulicity commercial. We already did that. Uh, Huff, 800. What's up in the house? James Anderson in the house. What's up? Uh, whole grain bread. <laughs> the wording, I got to blow myself. No. How do I make I'm glad somebody caught that stuff. That uh, was good. I'll probably get banned from Twitter for it, but yeah. That's, uh, that's good stuff. All right, uh, Hasa Gaming, can you please say any of your dialogue with the name Aziz, please? Uh, I did that the other day. What? Hasa, what are you doing? Are you making video clips of me? Are you making video clips of me, Hasa? Hmm? Are you? Don't you be doing that. Don't you be doing that. Don't be making video clips of me saying Aziz on some of the lines. I don't even know what Aziz means. So, no. I, although I just said it 500 times. All right? Uh, but at least you were nice about it. You said please. Okay. Let's go, uh, let's see what Mikey's up to. Mikey's only got one job. Got one job. Can he do it right? We'll find oh, out. Oh, man. I feel like crap. Oh, it's me every morning, man. Have my, have my cappuccino because I feel like crap. All right, let's go. I forgot a couple things that I need to do here. All right. 
There we go. There. All right. I don't mind these clothes. These clothes are all right for Mikey. The hair sucks. I got. I gotta get. I'm gonna go change the hair. I don't wanna hear about it, Jenny or Debbie or any of the other girls. We're going. Michael's still be hot even though he's bald. Let's go. Where's the hair place? Uh. You know, I, I can't handle the the. You know. Miami Vice haircut, you know, Don Johnson, Miami Vice, you know, maybe when Vice City comes out, I'll, I'll put that on him. But until then, until then, we're going to get a haircut. So I got some some guys asking me about doing collabs, and uh, first of all, I'm not real sure how to do a collab. Uh, Rafi wants me to do one. Dark Viper wants me to do one. Uh, that's Pegasus. Is that where I get my haircut? No, I get my haircut across the street. Where the hell do I get my haircut? Where's the guy? Where's where's Boulay or whatever his name is? There it is, Bob Moulet. That's where I got my Hands mullet in the air. from Knees Bob. On the ground, oh. Right now. Uh oh. Okay. Really? Alright. Is this what we're doing? Please. Don't do anything stupid. We're gonna kill you. Okay, don't worry, man. Don't worry. Don't worry. Where's the car? Where's the car? Where'd he go? Which way'd he go? Did I lose him? I lost him. Blue dot's gone. Dang it. I guess I should have done something actually in the place. I didn't know I pulled a pistol. I thought I was pulling a, uh, I thought I was pulling a machine gun, like an AK or something. But all right, well let's just go get my haircut. Sorry, Bob Malay, didn't get your money back for you. But I will get a haircut. Oh, they're closed? You! Alright, Jenny. I know, you probably the guys who sent the freaking crooks to do that, aren't you? Yeah. You guys, man. I can't even get my hair cut now. I gotta go do this. I gotta go do this job. I gotta go do this job with a mullet. The only ones who should have... The only ones who should have mullets are baseball players. And even they shouldn't have one. I'm gonna take this guy's car. That's my car. That's my car right there. That's my wheels right there, baby. All right. Let's go. All right. Shall we go see Martin Madrazo? Where is he? Where's Martin Matrazzo? Oh, there he is, way up here. All right. Let's go. So Martin Matrazzo it is. Look out! Oh, man, this car handles for shit. I gotta go fix it. Is there one right by here? Yeah, yeah, there's this. Let's do this first before I go to Martin Matrazzo. Let's go spend some money. I think I got money to spend. Right? Didn't I do a job? Yo, 
Sorry, Maud. Oh, that's not Maud. Maud's somewhere between joyful and peachy. What miracle did you want me to perform? If GTA 5 had watchdog hacks, why, Modest Knight? We don't need watchdog hacks. Can you shout my brother Joel? Jace? Yes, Joel. The Bugatti spawns nearby. Uh, Arthur, we need money. Arthur, we need money. Hope I'm doing well. I'm a legend. Uh, what does that say? I'm a legend. Looking forward to GTA 6 trailer? Yeah. Hope we get to see you return to GTA again. That would be nice. Aiden Jensen. Thank you. Aiden Jensen in the house. In the his house. Okay, let's put some armor on this thing. How much money do I have? $676,000. All right, we're going to upgrade this thing. We're going to upgrade this thing all the way, man. Race brakes. Don't want carbon panels. Where, where are the car? Oh, yeah, I definitely want those. Uh, engine, upgrade that fucker, exhaust, let's see if some of those big bores going, hood, we'll go carbon on that, horn, no, lights, no, plate, always gotta go yellow on black, uh, respray, absolutely, primary color, matte, midnight purple. Skirts. Don't want skirts? Yeah, let's do it. I would too. Spoiler. Here's the thing about spoilers. I hate those damn spoilers. I don't like spoilers. I don't mind that one too much, but I hate those big whale tails and stuff like that. I like just your standard deal that you get on there. This car does not have a spoiler. It does not need a spoiler. It needs a lower competition suspension and transmission. But it does not need, and it definitely needs turbo, but it doesn't need a spoiler. But we do need uh, bulletproof tires. How much money did I spend on that thing? I had 68,000, now I got 60,000? No, I had to spend, oh, I had 686, now I got 605. I spent $81,000. I just took a $120,000 car and made it a 200 and something thousand dollar car. But what are you gonna do, man? Windows. Dark smoke. Uh, that's it. Okay, exit. All right, anybody care to tell me how hot that car is now? Look at that. Look at that. Ooh, baby, that is one bad boy right there. Look at that. Mm -mm -mm. That's my real life car right there. Love that car. Hank Hill, hey, what's up, dude? Mike Kristen, can I pretty please get a shout out? My name is Mike. You just got one, dude. Ned, are you streaming from Vice City? <laughs> spoiler gives you more downforce. I, dude, you've obviously never driven an Audi. I don't need a freaking spoiler. Uh, Ned, are you from Danville? Yes, Chitch, I sure as fuck am from Danville. I'm a Danville kid, through and through. Ned Love from Bangladesh. Lil from Germany. Ned, me, Joey, Brian, and Jared are in a Blast Crew group on Instagram. You left earlier today. Are you joining back at some point? No, Kian, I'm not. Uh, I, don't, I don't get in those groups, dude. I don't get in those groups. Those groups are, you know, I, I just don't do it. Uh, are you straight streaming from Los Santos? No, I'm on a road trip. Do a burnout. I, I don't know. I'm not sure I know how to do a burnout. I guess I, what, I hold a brake and and squeal and then do it. I'll do one. You, you, you know, if this is a real Audi, you really can't burn them out. It's it's very difficult to do a burnout with an Audi because you got, you've got Quattro. You know, the, the traction goes to all the different things. Burnouts are a brake and traction. When you're driving a car for real, you don't want brakes and traction. You know, you don't want your back end breaking loose. You want to go <clears throat> like that. So that's why Audis are the best. Uh, are you still friends with Steven and Sean? Yes, absolutely. 
That's for uh, Michael Billigen or something like that. Brian Cardenas. Uh-oh. OBS Studio disconnected. Reconnecting? Did you guys lose me? Let me see. Okay. Let me know if you guys lost me. It appears that I'm back on there still. Let's pick up Amanda. I don't want to pick up Amanda. Uh, all right. It would appear that I'm fine. Okay. A burnout. There you go. I hope that made you happy. All right. Where am I going? Martin Madrazo's house. Let's go. Let's go over and see this crazy dude. Martin Madrazzo. I, I, I'm a Martin Madrazzo fan. The actor was really good. I can't remember who it was. I, I liked him until he hit me with the uh, with the baseball bat. Uh oh, blue dot. Oh man, is it these guys? These guys are gonna mess up my car. They're gonna mess up my car. I just. Let me get ahead of them. Do I have this? Yeah, I do. Where are they? They're behind me. Missed. I don't want to mess up my car. I just glitched. I just, I just did a little bump, a little stop thing on the screen. Messed me up. Okay, get ahead of them. Missed again. That's not going to work, I don't think. about my car anymore. I cannot drive and shoot at the same time. Just can't do it. I suck. I want to blow him up with the with the RPG. Are they heading to their to their clubhouse? God dang it, I'm hung up on a tree. Pole, whatever it is. Man, I went from driving really well to driving like shit. All right, here we go. Enough of that, I'm gonna catch this guy now.
trying to force a stop on this guy. I know, I'm in an F9 and he's in a freaking uh, Chevy van or whatever and I can't catch the guy. Alright, I'm just going to take him out. Oh, I missed him! RPG. What's he doing? He's going to Vanilla Unicorn? Don't mess with my girls! There. Finally. I gotta retrieve whatever this is. What was it? A wallet. All that for two grand? Now I gotta return it? Alright, that guy's out of luck unless he's on the way to Martin Madrazzo's house. Let's go to Martin Madrazzo. Where is that guy? Oh, he's not very far away, I don't think. Yeah, he's too far away. I'm gonna keep it. I'm gonna keep that two grand. Help pay for the repairs on my car. Uh oh, look out. There's some more repairs needed. 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 Oh my God. This has turned into a complete fiasco. I don't want to mess up my car. Bam, bam. It's like, forget about it, man. My car is so screwed up now. It's like ridiculous. All right. Oh, look out. I wasn't paying attention. Hey Michael, are you in fitness protection? Dark Viper says you are not. What does Dark Viper know? Dark Viper's from Australia, man. Michael's an American. He doesn't know how he doesn't know how witness protection works. He thinks you gotta be convicted of something. Nobody has to be convicted of anything to go into witness protection. That's why they call it witness protection. You're getting protected. You know, maybe you testified and and uh, uh, the guy got off. You need protection because he's gonna come looking for you. You know, like Trevor came looking for me. It's 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 witness protection does not require a conviction of any sort. Just so you know. So next time you talk to Dark Piper, you can let him know that. Ned High from Russia. You're the best actor. I'll get a little Roma. Hello, Roma. Aiden Jensen. Have you ever been to Scotland? No. And we want to. I wanted to go to Edinburgh show, but they didn't. Uh, they didn't invite us. I know that's where the Rockstar offices are. Uh, yeah, we worked with Scottish guys. It was uh, that's Rockstar North, I believe, is is Scotland. So all those guys are Scottish, man. There's like you can't understand a fucking word they're saying. You know, the only one that was harder to understand than those guys was the director because he was from Stoke on Trent, and. Uh, that's a, that's a heavy accent right there if you're not from around there, man. So uh, let's see what else is going on here before I go see Martine uh, real quick. That was some bad driving, I know. Uh, I remember asking you to sign that the first time. What? Hang on. Let me see. I gotta go back up here a little ways and see what's up. Huff 800 on the rebuild. Okay. Uh, Bruno Koteski. That sounds like Russian or something. 
Uh, hey, Ned, you seem to have a good relationship with San and Play. Can you please give a shout out to one of his friends, Jogan Dofodachi? Especially Jean Cosmico. They really like me. Okay, cool. There's your shout out. Uh, there's Hassan again. Anything with with Aziz? Aziz! I forget a thousand things every day, Aziz. How about you make sure this is one of them? And don't ask me again. Uh, Charles Smith. Ned, you ever told the true story of the deal Mike made with Dave Norton? Everyone theorizes, but surely you know what actually happened. Uh, Trevor was supposed to go down, dude. And then he walked in the way of the bullet. Brad did, so he bought it. And then Michael bought the fake bullet or the rubber bullet or whatever it was. And there you go. There's your story. Rockstar waited until everyone grows up to announce GTA 6. That's funny. Yeah, I don't know how to say that name, but yeah, that's 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 what they did. They waited for everyone to grow up. All you guys out there that got that got GTA 5 when you weren't supposed to, now you can legitimately get GTA 6 when it comes out. Good job. You don't need mommy and daddy to go buy it for you or your big brother. Uh, Rockstar waited until everybody came. <laughs> Red grows up to announce it. I love it. Anyway, thanks for being such a great game. I can't count the number of times I replayed. Love from L.A. Angry Duckling Institution. Ned, was there a specific design and tie-in reason to GTA San Andreas when Michael mentions they're talking, taking his wife's car in the stolen yacht mission? Uh, no, I don't think so. Could be. You know, everybody does, everybody does throwbacks, you know, uh, to, uh, you know... Especially things that have like old, old issues. Like, you know, you'll see a lot of throwbacks. Uh, uh, like, like say Cobra Kai, for example. If you watch that, you'll see a ton of throwbacks in there where they say something that references, you know, Karate Kid or Karate Kid Two or Three or whatever. So you have a lot of that kind of stuff, and I would imagine that there's stuff in there from uh, GTA Four, Three, Two, One, but. You know, to me, yeah, take two stocks are going crazy. No shit, Baba Ganoush. Uh, I told my I told my guy two years ago to buy that shit, and he bought it, and then he sold it when it was going well, and now it's like going through the roof probably. How was it working with Rockstar? Awesome. These guys are awesome. That's like the best. You want to work for somebody and have fun? That's who you want to go work for. Uh, YOLO. Hi, Ned. Watching your stream from Italy. Morning, Ned. Much love, brother. Love your character. Thank you, uh, my nuts take you stink. Oh, my nut sack stinks. I don't know, whatever that is. <laughs> Nicole Bell, I remember asking you to sign that the first time we spoke on Instagram Live. Sign what? I don't, I, I'm, I'm, I'm missing out on that, Nicole. I'm not sure. Namaste, Michael. Namaste, Miguel. Yes. Uh, I know you want me to say that. I'm going to go fuck yourself. Okay. Hi. Thanks for your performance, GTA from the Netherlands. How about that? Marin Ivigenko from the Netherlands in the house. Uh, oh, there's my there's my FBI friend. Cool. Uh, love your work, sir, from India. Thank you, Aniket. Kuna, do you think GTA 6 will have a similar sad and dark story? I, you know, I don't know. With the romance and stuff, it's probably going to be like some kind of, uh, who knows, you know? I think it's going to be really funny. I hope it's really funny, you know? Uh, I can tell you that Rupert uh, Humphrey is a funny fucker, man. You know, the writer, one of the, one of the main writers, and it's, I'm sure it's going to be very funny. Uh, hey, man, loved your performance in GTA Five. Wishing you all the best. Can you shout out my friend Toby from Regensburg, Bavaria? I just did. All right, let's do this mission. So, uh, in this mission, this is uh, everybody loves this this line that's coming up. This scene, the cutscene. This cutscene was a fucking blast to shoot. Uh, it, <laughs> you know, I was having a really hard time keeping a straight face because. Steven was so funny in this, man. It was one of the ones where he was super funny. And 
it was it was a lot of uh, it was a lot of fun. You'll you'll see if you haven't seen it or whatever. I, if I if I think of anything when when we're watching it, I'll pause and 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 comment on it. What's up, Bradley Short? What's up there? It's wanted. What what is this? Peach body oil, greatest smell in the world. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I've seen some bad driving, but you. Oh yes, yes, yes. Okay, yes, I remember. I remember Nicole. Yes. I actually did a. Uh, I think I did a, uh, a, a little video of that line uh, when I lived in New York. But anyway, all right. So let's go. Let's go on this. I better put that thing away. Hey Ned, pay my college tuition. Yeah, I got to pay my son's college tuition. What he what he doesn't have from his scholarship for baseball. So I'm not going to be doing that. You said you wanted work. This is work. Uh huh. And who's the guy? You'll see. Yes. Hi. <laughs> Whoa. Hello. Hello. <laughs> We're looking for Mr. Madrazo. A grace giver, fuck's sake, just let him in. Right this way, gentlemen. Ooh, Patricia, get us something to drink with you. Quick, please! Hey, good to see you again, Michael. <laughs> Likewise. It's my friend Trevor. Uh, sit down. Sit, sit, sit. So what did you tell him about me, about Martin Madrazo? Martin's an old friend of mine, Trevor. The truth. Martin is a terrifying psychopath who tried to kill me. Exactly. <laughs> but some people, they no longer fear me as much as they used to. People who wear clothes to me. Uh, my cousin, uh, you married my cop. <laughs> well, apparently, he's thinking about testifying against... Oh, this isn't that Randall. one. This is the one where we... Oh, well. Oh, right. By you. Our debt was settled. <laughs> This is the track, the plane one. Her this friend. is well. It comes at the end of but this. Does friendship mean nothing these days? Ah, uh, hello. What's the deal? This is him, Javier. He's flying off for Liberty City this afternoon. <whistles> and he's taking some files of mine, innocent files that um, I need back. There's a gun set up in the hills. I had a man watching at the airport. We'll let you know, and when he flies by. Shoot it down and get the files back. A lot of Man, indicating. <laughs> huh? Trevor, come on. You still want the drink? Not now! Pendeja! Que no ves que estoy hablando con las gentes aquí? All right. You grab a vehicle, something versatile. I'll handle the gun. All right. Insider 4. What's up, man? Thank you. Uh, am I excited for the new trailer coming out Tuesday? Oh yeah, man! I can't wait Let's to see it. Let's get in touch on the headsets. Can't wait to see it. So you should have saved the R8 in the garage first. No offense. Uh, it's gonna get impounded. I don't care. Whatever. Uh, do I still have it here? Oh man! Did I just waste all that money? Is that what you're telling me? Oh well, no biggie. I'm gonna take a cab anyway. <laughs> I'm gonna take a cab anyway. <laughs> what do I care? All right, where do I have to go? Oh, I gotta go there. Okay, they got it marked. All right, so one of your finest taxis. Wait, I don't say that. That's what's his face. Freelander. I might have to go do a Freelander thing here in a little bit. cab here as soon as possible. Stay where you are. I got a driver right around the corner. Thank you. BK Batman likes GTA 5. I do too, buddy. It's good shit. Good shit, right? Gotta like it. I got a fast cab. If you get a thousand things, make sure you one of them. I'd love to hear this one, please. Yatharth Srivastava. Uh, yeah, you know, you do forget a thousand things every day. I'm about to make sure this is one of them. I don't care about all that title. Get in the van. All 
All right, so this is probably going to be... You nearby? Not far out. Shoot the plane down and I'll be ready. T, if you could see this gun, it might convince you my team of Drazzo ain't someone to be messing with. Where is it? I don't see nothing yet. There it is. Out past downtown. Gotta shoot in front to compensate for the speed of the jet. That'll go down next time. Nope. Nope. How much compensation do I need? I, I can never pull this one off, man. I suck at this so Shit. bad. Give me a second. Am I too late or too early? Ha, not good enough. That didn't do it. Ah, gotta take another shot. How how soon how soon do I have to shoot this thing? I don't this is the thing I don't get. Uh here, I'm gonna let me scroll down here. I wanna see. That's the wrong plane? Oh, well that makes sense. No wonder. Because <laughs> I, I was pretty sure I was on that sucker. <laughs> I should have been okay. Let's try this one again. Where's the plane? The plane, boss. The plane. I got her. Southwest oh, of the city. It's the red target. The jet's moving. Yeah, that would make sense. Lead. That would make some sense. One shot, baby. One. Oh, wait. I got to do another one. Shoot, I thought I was done. Two shots, baby! Two! Is that it? Where is it? They gotta hit him again? Oh my god. That'll go Missed down him. next time. No, it won't, because that's not gonna be a next time. Because I can't find it. There it is. Where is it? Where is it? Are you kidding me? I gotta do three shots. I thought I had him with two. Why is he acting like he played this for the first time when his character in the game acts like he never played it before? Dude, I don't remember. I haven't played this thing in a while. I don't remember how all this shit works. But now I do. This there first shot's easy. I'll pass downtown. Gotta shoot in front to compensate for the speed of the jet. Two shots. Got him. Three shots. That's right. That's right. Because I played the game before. Now I got to follow him on the motorcycle. Go, Trevor, on the dirt bike. Where's he going? Oh, there it is. Now, if I'm not mistaken, there's a lot of rocks and stuff. A lot of things for Trevor to run into here. Keep your eyes ahead. Big jump, big jump. Had a baby. Good job, Trevor. Oh! Are you kidding me? Oh, my God. Come on, get over there. Trevor is so slow. He's like the slowest runner. 
Let me get him. Slow, man. He's so slow. Everybody thought Steven was going to be the fastest. He was the slowest. <laughs> wrong plane. I can't believe I went to the wrong plane. Oh, my God. I forgot to tell the story about the leather jacket. I told the story about the leather jacket. Leather jacket was my leather, leather jacket. My actual real life leather jacket. I've got that. Maybe I'll bring it on one of these streams and show you guys. Already off the bike? Get back on it, dummy. Get back on it. Where is it? Can't find it. It's in the tree. What the hell? Where's the bike? There it is. Get on it. Where is he? There he is. Ah! No, I gotta pay attention because I gotta do. Uh... All right, wait. Can you say my name? Nemanja. There you go. I said your name. Uh. Yeah, I gotta pay attention here. Okay, I gotta quit glancing over at this stuff and just go here. All right, here we go. This stream is cursed. Stay on the bike, Trevor. Where's the plane? I don't even see it. Where's where's the plane? Oh my god, I'm so far off course, it's unbelievable. I gotta go. Where? I, I just said it. I just said it. I gotta pay attention. I can't look at the screen. And what do I do? I look at the screen and I and I don't even find the I don't even find the plane. The plane. Alright. Pay attention this time. Ah, there it is. Okay. Now I can glance at the screen. Seriously, you played Michael character? Yes, seriously. There you go. You gotta be kidding me. Alright, I gotta look at the screen. What jacket? I got a leather jacket that the uh that they used for the, the stuff. Am I mixed with Italian? No, I'm not. <laughs> I'm just Southside Chicago. Uh, this isn't motocross. <laughs> All right. Oh, man. Yash Stacker. Here we go, baby. Uh, a. All right, here we go. I'm going to get it this time. This is like, what's going on? Where is it? Oh, there we go. All right. I even said it on the first round. Watch out for trees and boulders and all that kind of crap. But, you know, now I'm paying attention. All right? I'm not going to lose it this you time. You think I can clear two lanes of traffic? Yes, definitely. Whoa. <laughs> These guys, these guys playing the pilots are actually really good. Around 
Amazing what you can do when you actually pay attention. Put this guy out of his misery. All right, where's the files? Is this them? Files in here? Yeah. It's gonna blow. Get out of there. What's my opinion on banana peppers? Big old Batman, I love banana peppers. I put them on everything. Nice one, uh, done perfectly, says meme. You know what? <coughs> you gotta pay attention. You know, it's just that simple. I'm actually, I can actually play the game, but I just, I just gotta, you know, I gotta pay attention to what I'm doing. I can't be reading comments. Ned just executed this man. I didn't execute him. I put him out of his misery. And the guy was gonna die. Oh, destroy the van. Okay. Let me destroy the van. Sticky bomb? All right, I gotta use the gasoline. That's Trevor's gig, isn't it? Excuse me, sir, I'd like to borrow your car. May I borrow your car? Thank you, ma'am. Is this a rag top? We gotta call the sheriff. Call the sheriff, hurry. Ah! Don't go over there, you're gonna get blown up. Do I have cops I got to deal with here, or can I just drive? Oh no, God, this car handles like crazy. There's that breakaway back end. Trevor. 
Nothing you wouldn't do. Trevor! Trevor! Ah, I wouldn't do. Somehow I don't believe that. <coughs> that was on purpose, by the way. I just want to get this guy's car. Smoke, I'm gonna be smoking you if you don't watch out, dude. That wasn't on purpose. Alright. I hate driving in the hills. Oh, oh, what's this? Is that an inferno? Oh, man. Come back here. Ah. Oh, no. This is like a G Fred or something, man. I gotta try to survive this. I gotta work on it. I gotta practice. That's the result of taking too many taxis. Oh my god. <clears throat> All right. I redid my joystick, my my controller. So, I don't know if if I'm just really sucking because did I make it too sensitive or not sensitive enough? I don't I don't know. But I'm sure driving for shit today, man. Holy crap. All right, here we go. So, this is the scene, probably one of the, the most favorite scenes in all of the game. Uh... I boo all electric cars. Is this an electric car? Honky Tonk, Tennessee? Is that what this is, an electric car? Chev Shellius, Springfield, Illinois. Joshua Carr, Springfield. We used to put the... Yes, I did say that. Uh, Jason McDermott, or Demerit. Uh, can you actually slow down time in real life? Or is that just... No, that was, that was real life, you know? That was real life. But anyway, okay, so this is Nike or Adidas. It depends. Sweatpants, Adidas, shoes, Nikes, uh, G Games. Uh, have you ever met or talked with Roger Clark or even Rob? I worked with those guys, Vipsy, on uh, Red Dead 2. So, yes. Yes. In fact, we're going to be doing a. Uh, a little crossover thing at a couple of Comic Cons this year at Indie Pop and uh, I think Phoenix Gamer Con. We're all going to be there solo, me, Roger, and Rob. And uh, it's going to be a blast. So watch for that if you're in that area. That'll be in Indianapolis and Phoenix. Check it out. We're coming. Uh, Kelvin Marcus, can you say my name? Oh, wait, I mean, can I say your name? Yes, Kelvin Marcus. Okay, so this is a, this is a scene that everybody loves. This is like one of the top scenes, probably one of our favorite to act in, because this is really funny, and there's a lot of crazy reaction in it. Like, I, I get all worked up, and Trevor, Tre you know, Steven was so good in this scene, man. I, this, as far as, to me, as far as humor goes, this to me was his best scene, because he doesn't go super way over the top with all the growling and, and all that kind of shit. He played it really true to the, true to the thing, and to me, this is this is like his his best. This is this was the best uh, comedy scene for me in this thing. So let's go there and watch it unfold. Where? 
Where is he? Then we'll make me small. So we don't block any of this. around with people like that, Mike. I mean, really, I Tom, don't. That's a fucking question. I asked for a fair day's pay after a fair day's work. And he kind of got a little angry. So I admit, I kind of got a little angry. Did you kill him? What kind of fucking animal do you take me for? No, I didn't <laughs> kill him. Oh, fuck. But I did kidnap his <laughs> wife. Oh, oh. oh. Oh, oh shit. shit. What the fuck what did, did you, you do? do? <laughs> oh, I just told you what I just did. Oh, now, shit. Uh, unfortunately, I think that we're going to have to lay low for a little while while, you know, we discuss things with Martin. Oh, you think? Why don't you call <laughs> me back? All right, now, Patricia, she already called Shotgun. <laughs> now, I know a nice little place we can... Hang out, you know, it's a, a very relaxing little spot. A little getaway, if you will. A cabin in the woods. You know what I'm saying. <laughs> oh my god. 63%. Oh boy, I'm sucking so bad. Alright. Oh god. That is such a great cutscene, man. That is such a great cutscene. But you see what I'm saying there, like about about Steven in that scene, he he just played it, you know, he played it, he played it so perfectly, you know. You know, I asked him for an honest day's work for an honest day's job, you know, whatever, or honest day's pay for an honest day's work. And he kind of got a little angry. And then I kind of got a little angry, you know. And, and it's just, it was really good because he he kind of downplayed it a little bit and I went crazy, like, with the, the big reactions, like, you know, did you, did you, Trevor, answer the question, did you fucking kill him, or whatever it was, you know, and it just, it just worked, it just worked really well, that was, that was such a good scene, that's one, I, I it's one of the things I like about doing this playthrough, is that I go back, and I, and, and it re, I remember things that we did, you know, in the in, when we were shooting the thing, you know, when we were when we were actually making the game, and it comes back to me, and you remember like performances and like what what was cool in the performance. And for me, from a comedy standpoint, that was that was Steven's best. I, and out of all, now I gotta say that that there's some things that got cut out that maybe were as good, but the the gameplay probably just didn't work. Uh, suck Johnny too. Uh, what's up, man? 10 years of GTA five. Can't wait to see six. Much love. Thanks, bro. Uh, anyway, uh, have you, Vipsy wants to know if I've ever seen Lost Boys with Keith or Sutherland. That's kind of a non sequitur, but yeah, I have. Anyway, it's cool to play this thing and see like, you know, cause it brings back a lot of memories, old memories. Cause you know, we're talking about what, 12 years ago something like that and uh did steven Ogg carry the actress in real life yeah of course threw her right in there uh and she was awesome by the way i you know i don't know who played mrs madrazo but she was so good i mean she has stuff later on there's another funny thing where she says to trevor gasolina no boom smacks him <laughs> I, I think i start cracking up in that and i and, and i know I know I did in real life, and I think that that I think that's in the game actually, where I crack up when she does that. But I don't remember. But I, I know in real life I did, for sure. So, uh, but she was funny, yeah. Uh, she seems happy. I'll rove. Oh, you know she's she's you know got a little uh, Stockholm syndrome blowing there. You know, hey, you know. You never know, you don't know what people are going to see in people. You know what I mean? 
it's like Michael Loki hoping Trevor did kill Martine. No, no, not at all, because we need him in GTA Online. <laughs> but, yeah. Uh, hello from Finland. Wow. Matthew Coggins in the house. Who else we got here? Shandu Umith. I guess you're in Canada. I have a friend who hasn't played GTA 5. Tell this. What's his name? Elric? Yeah, you play a thousand games every day, Elric. How about you make sure GTA is one of them, you dumbass? <laughs> that was Shandu's uh, first super stream. <laughs> I don't know why. If you forget a thousand things every day, that means the average American will forget 28,200 or 28,207,200 things across their lifetime. I love when we get mathematicians in the house. Yo, you are a good mathematician. Uh, I can't wait for the line I hear Stockholm Central. Yeah, that's that's one of my favorite lines, Dalton. That is definitely one of my favorite lines, no doubt. It's right up there, top top five probably. Uh, why does Steven appear so little with you and Stolo? Uh, Charles, I don't know, man. I guess he chose A. Sniper. In the house, sniper. What is that? XP 101. All right. Did his first super uh, super chat. I don't know what these super chats and everything are. It's kind of cool. Uh, hey Ned, it's my friend Rainer's birthday. Can you give him the Michael Townley happy birthday? You mean like yeah, happy fucking birthday, Rainer? What kind of name is Rainer or Rainier or or Rear Indier? I don't know. Whatever it is. Uh, <laughs> It was very nice, Ned. Uh, love from the UK, Josh. What's happening, bro? Uh, old Grain Bed's back. Do you ever watch TV? I saw every episode of him in The Walking Dead. Of course. I'm going to support anything that guy does. I've, I've watched everything he's done. Uh, that's my boy. Brock Obama in the house. Well, what do you know? It's Brock, though. Not Barack, but it's Brock. Hey, hey Ned, Mr. Luke, a.k.a. Michael DeSanta. You're one of my childhood memories, and I can't say how thankful I am. You are important to everyone from our community. Love you so much. Greetings from, oh, from Croatia. That's why your name's Brock instead of Barack. All right, cool. No, well, thanks for that, buddy. Uh, okay, so what is that? Oh, Jesus, he's taking her to camp. <laughs> Can you say hi, check? Hi, check. Uh, hey, Alicia. Make me a producer, what? Make me a producer tag right quick, just to say, Tonio made it, bitch, what? Okay. Do you know what 5M is? Yeah, I know what 5M is. Of course I do. Uh, speaking of 5M, uh, Solo has his, his uh, reworked Franklin World. Uh, Franklin's World 5M is gonna be launching, relaunching, I believe, in a couple of weeks. So keep your eyes peeled for that. Yes, Mr. Goblin, I do have a channel. Uh, what is Steven's favorite line? I don't know. He probably doesn't even remember any of his lines. Uh, love from Poland. Do I practice yoga? No, but my wife does, if that counts. She was actually a yoga instructor. Uh, okay, so I'm back to being Franklin. How long have I been on here? Hour and 40. We're about to wrap it up then. Is there anything I can do really quick before... I wrap this thing up. That's Trio, homie. Yeah, that's Trio. Uh, actually, no. I don't think there. I think it's where we're gonna pick it up next time. So let me do a quick save here just to make sure we're okay. I remember when I first started doing this, I forgot to save everything. I just thought it would do it automatically. That's how dumb I am. Now, what are you going to do with Chop, Franklin? You're, you're on a motorcycle. Chop can't ride a motorcycle. Hey, boy, follow the bike. Oh, follow the bike. Okay. I got it. Does that mean I have to drive slow? How about that? Is that good? How's he going to keep up with this bike? Where's poor Chop? I'm going off the edge here. Oh, jump. 
jump. Bam! That didn't work. I was going to try to do a backflip. Let's see if Chop wants to play fetch. You want to play fetch, Chop? Here we go. Let's play fetch. Let's see if we can hit this girl with the ball. Mash, Chop, mash. Get him, Chop. What's that M blinking for? Why is that M blinking? I've never seen that. What is that M? Oh, we're laying low. That's right. So, what was? Why was that M blinking? That's uh, what is that? Madrazo? Michael. What? What? How? How is he gonna go to Michael? Michael's laying low. Or I just go to Michael's house, and nobody's there. And then I call him. That's probably what it is. All right, forget that. All right, let's get get out of here uh, for today. What I'm gonna do is uh... here's what we'll do. I'll switch over to GTA Online. And see how long it takes me to get booted. Uh, wait a minute. I want to do that from settings, right? Let's go to settings. No, I got to do game. Uh, is that right? Or do I just do online? Play GTA Online. Oh, yeah. Invite-only session. Okay. I I'm still going to get kicked. I guarantee you. This invite-only thing and having a VPN, I'm still going to get kicked. Watch. So let's see what happens. If I get kicked, that'll be the end of the stream. Have I ever been to Missouri? Yeah. Dually Cat. Many times. Dude, I'm from Illinois. So, Absolutely. There I am. Not again. Skeet says, not again. Save the game. I already saved it. We're good. Uh, okay. How do you feel about the new GTA Online, especially the wild roaming? Yeah, that's cool, man. The, the wildlife's going to be good. Uh, Yusuf's coming back, I guess. Is that right? Yusuf's coming back? Dude, that's going to be... Uh, uh. That could be very funny, but who knows? I, I don't. I I don't do a very good use of. Uh, let's go to the casino. See if I can spin the wheel without getting without getting booted. <laughs> oh, let me text my FBI friend back. All right, there we go. So, I'm gonna spin that wheel. So now here I am in, in, in uh, what are the dogs doing? I gotta look at what the dogs are doing right there. Oh, they're all, they're all sleeping. Nice, what good boys. Uh, all right. <clears throat> this looks good so far. For how long, though? That's the question. Let's go spin the wheel. Happy birthday, Tom!
Have you seen the new Batman with Robert Pattinson? No, I've not seen that. Decent podium vehicle. Yeah. Ah, we need a tug update. He's so cute. Yeah, tug is cute, man. He's he's uh, in a very ornery place right now in his life. A little slow spin. Let's get that car. Come on, baby. Bite, bite. Ah. All right, stretch, stretch. No clothing. Stretch, stretch. Get to the chips. There we go. That'll work. I'll take the chips. Thank you. Congratulations, I won 20,000 chips. Let's go blow them. Let's see. Oh, look at this poor guy. I should get back to the office. Yeah, yeah, you probably should, dude. You know, your life sucks now. I think that's the first time I've ever talked to that guy. Well, him talk to me. All right, let's go over here. I'm going to go to the blackjack table, see what happens. Does this chick say anything, or is she just always texting? I guess she just always texts. She's always there in that outfit, little jean denim denim outfit, and she never says anything. She's just texting. All right, we're going high stakes. I'm going to blow 50 grand right here. Oh man, the table's acapado. All right, let's go over here then. I'm gonna blow 50 grand. Here we, what? None of the blackjack tables are open? Wait, is that blackjack there? Oh, I hate this chick. She always takes all my money. All right, let's see if we can get her this time. Hello, oh shoot, end seat, end seat. Nope, nope, no end seat. That's bad luck. I wanna go over here. Let's go. Got to get over one seat. There we go. Okay, All right, that's good. Bet. Max bet fifty grand. Let's go, baby. All bets are closed. Best of luck. What is that? A nine? Twenty here. Ooh. Ten. Fight. Nope. You want another? No. I could double down on that, but I'm not going to. We've got Ten. 15. Plus 50. Let's go. Let it ride, baby. Please place your bets. What? Wait a minute. She had 20? I thought she had 19. Oh my god. Alright, let's try it again. Let us begin. Nine. Fifteen there. Four. Fifteen. Four. No, I'm gonna sit. St. Petersburg, Dmitry Trysk. Dealer wins. Bitch. I'm telling you, she cleans me out all the time. If I get a good hand, she pushes. If I get a shitty hand, she kills me. Hello from Sweden, Sammy Chrisborg. All bets are closed. Best of luck. Oh, come on, baby. Ten, baby. Blackjack. Boom. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. A nine. Ooh. Split them. Another? Do I have enough money to split them? Yes. Where, what, what is that? RB? Split. Come on. 10. Bam. 20. Bam. 14. 14. That sucks. Another? What's he got? It's your play. I can't see what you got. Get out of the way, dealer. How do I look at the dealer's cards? RT. Nine. Yeah, I got to take a hit on that one. Oh, wait. I said hold. Shit. All right. Bust out. Bust. 19. Well, I went on one of them. I meant to take a hit on that other one on the 13, on the 14, or the four. I screwed up. Hey, Ned. Happy holidays. I am 20 years old from Danville, Illinois. My your achievement as an actor. Eddie Quintana from Danville. Danville kid. What's up, Eddie? All right, my man. Shit, that's my hometown, Danville, Illinois. Some talent came from Danville, Illinois. Athletic talent. Acting talent. We have Gene Hackman, Dick Van Dyke, Jerry Van Dyke, Bobby Short, who was a great piano player, singer, uh, Donald O'Connor, dancer, entertainer, actor from, uh, if you ever saw 
Singing in the Rain. He played Cosmo in Singing in the Rain. Danville Kid. And then there's this guy who's in video in some video game called GTA 5, Ned Luke. I don't know. You know whatever. He's a hack. But the other guys, whoo. First thing I ever did, Scarecrow in The Wizard of Oz was at Danville High School. That's the thing that got me hooked. Hillbilly on TV. He hillbilly. That's what I live for. Hillbilly's on my blood feud. For as long as she's been there, she most writing a book on that phone. <laughs> she must be writing a book on the phone. Yeah, no doubt. Uh, hey, from Turkey. We love you, Ned. All right. Cool. Thanks, Try. Uh, should I play another hand? I'm going to play another hand. I, I, I'm still in here, man. I'm still in here. Guess what? Oh, somebody's trying to do all kinds of dumb shit stuff with, uh, with, uh, hang on. I'm about to boot somebody, so bear with me. Unless, uh, unless, of course, Jenny already got him, <laughs> which is a good, good possibility. You guys got to watch out, man. Jenny's a bulldog. Don't get too crazy, though, Jenny. You know, be nice. Uh, all right, that's gone, I guess. Cool. All right, so, uh, Victory, can you say your name? But that's not your name. Ned Luke and Roger Clark, the legendary actors. Well, thank you there, Face Storm. I appreciate it. Um, all right, let's do a hand here. Okay. I'm going to max bet it out again. Bets are done. Let us begin. Let us begin. Nine. It's 11. Ooh, 11. Double down, baby. Double down. Double down. Double down. Give me a face card. Got a 14. Oh, my God. Are you freaking kidding me? 10. 21. Oh, sure. Of course. I, I hate this girl. She, she just destroys me. Every time I go in this damn thing and get her, I, I get killed. She's like... She's dirty, man. She's dirty. I'm telling you, she's dirty. Quit. B. Sorry, Goodbye. Maybe next time ah, shut up better. next time. Never next time with you. All right, so I just blew, I don't know, 150,000 in chips. Where's the exit to this place? I can't get out. I guess I got to play roulette. All right. Roulette. Here we go. You know what? I'm going to lay 50. Oh, 40. Uh, max bet. 5,000? That's the max bet? All right, uh, I'm gonna put it on black. I'm just gonna go straight black. Boom. Uh, okay, spin it. Come on, baby. Let's go black. Black, 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 black. Great. Bets are now closed. Let's begin. I bet 15,000 on black. Let's go. Come on, man. Oh, wheel cam. Black, baby. Black, black, black. Yeah, baby. Just like real life. Black 22. Yee-hee. All right, so that gets me, what, 30,000? Go again. Excellent. No, I'm not going to go again. I'm going to take my money and run. I don't think I've ever played blackjack in real life. Uh, I will say this. I, I, I haven't gone to Vegas a lot of times, but here's a little story, all right? I'm going to tell you guys a story. It's a good story. It's about a young girl named... Trisha. I thought Trisha's name was Trevor. Uh, oh, I can get a thousand dollars in chips here. Let me get those real quick. Might as well. This is how you gotta grind, man. You gotta grind on on this game if you want to have a lot of money. You know, either that or buy shark cards. But so anyway, I, I I don't go to Vegas a lot. My brother does, but I don't go to Vegas a lot. But the first time when I moved to L.A., right? I moved to LA, happy birthday, Binka. Uh, and I'm driving out to LA, 
And I don't have money. I got like, I, I went to LA with like $600 is all I had. And by the time I hit Vegas, I had about $200 left. And I had to rent an apartment. I had, you know, all this stuff. And I was going there. I had a job lined up. And I was going to have to pay rent because this, this, the people where I worked in Illinois, in Chicago, they had a kid who lived out there who ran a, a formal wear store. And I was going to crash with him, which he didn't like because it cramped his style. Because, you know, anyway, uh, so I hit Vegas with like $200. And I go, you know what? I'm going to get out. I'm going to play the slots. So I get out, I parked it, I got out of the car, and I'm walking down the strip, and there's this girl, and I mean, she was hot, smoking hot, right? And she's there by this, this slot machine, right? Here, we'll do it as we go. And so she's at this slot machine, and she's like, hey, this one's about to hit. This one's gonna hit, you gotta play this one. And I'm like going, really? Because I was just a, I was just some dumb hill jack from you know, Illinois. And she's like, yeah, yeah, you got to hit this one. This one's going to hit. So I sat down. And I put in the money, right? How do you do that? One bet is 500, max bet. So I put in the money and I spun. And that didn't happen. It hit. Boom, just like she said. She said it was about to hit. And it hit, bing, 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 bing. Big old money, I get that stuff, I put it in my pocket, man, and I take off. I didn't tip her, nothing. I just took off, because I didn't know any better. So I just took off, and I'm going down the street, I'm like, oh man, that's cool. I get to another one, and there's another really hot girl sitting there, and she says, this one's about to hit, same deal. I go in there, I played it one time, didn't hit. She goes, go again, go again, go again. I promise it's gonna hit. And, and boom, it hit again, bam. I walked out with $1,000, so I had 400 more than I left home with. I left with $1,000, I didn't tip either one, and didn't realize until years later that they were hookers. <laughs> I didn't know any better. I was such an idiot. I didn't know any better, but those were hookers. And, and they were just, you know, they were hoping that I would score on the, on the game, and, you know, and then, I guess, take them out. <laughs> or whatever but I didn't do it because I was a good boy I didn't actually I wouldn't it's not that I was a good boy it was that I was just I was just like thanks thanks so much you know and then I go back and you know whatever so what car do I have out here the, the Deluxo am I excited about the GTA trailer dropping on December 5th from Cobra uh, yes I, I mean I'm not going to say I'm excited but I am it's exciting you know, it's very exciting. But, uh, yeah, what happens in Vegas stays in Vegas, right, Ibrahim? Uh, <clears throat> but, yeah, I, I think it's going to be cool. I'm going to live stream it if uh, if, uh, if I can. That's not, that's not my car. It is my car, but that's not my car. All right, so I guess being in an invite-only thing is... is and getting in it from the game, I guess that's kind of protected. Uh, it's not much fun. Go into your settings where you don't have the tap, tap, the X button, and run. You can just hold it down. I think I have that. I just do that by habit. Let's see. Well, maybe I don't. Uh... Settings. Where's that? Gamepad? Sprint mode. Oh, I can see it. Hold to sprint. Tap to sprint. Hold to sprint. That's it. Oh, I had that. I had it set up for that. I just, I just didn't do it. See? If I hold that button. But he's not really sprinting. I can go faster than that. See? If I tap, I can go faster. And I like to go fast. You know, I was a track guy. So... What I learned from that story is that hookers are good at gambling. Yeah, I mean it doesn't, it doesn't have, it doesn't hurt to listen to the hookers in uh, in Vegas, you know. So,
Uh, okay, let me see. Where am I? What type of music do you like listening to, Iris? Uh, pretty much everything. Well, you know, I, I have to admit, I'm not a huge rap guy. I used to like it, but, you know, uh, rap nowadays is a little different than it was back in the day of Sugar Hill Gang. <laughs> Okay, this is just boring here. I, I, I can't I can't do this without other other guys in here. I, I don't care if they're trying to kick me out. I need the modders. I need the modders big time. So I'm gonna wrap this thing up. I'm gonna go park this uh, this guy. Maybe I'll just go really high up here and jump off. Quick drop. Boom. All right. So I'm going to wrap this thing up. I've been on here too long. And uh, thanks for coming in again. Everybody get excited, but hold on. Don't get too excited about uh, December 5th. December 5th is going to be great. It's happening in the morning. 5 a.m. in L.A. 5 a.m. in L.A. Have fun getting up. <laughs> 8 a.m. here. I'm going to probably, or no, 9 a.m., so 6 a.m. in L.A., my bad. But I'm going to stream it. Uh, I'm going to try to live stream during that time. I want to have 100,000 followers by then, subscribers on YouTube. So let's get going. Get everybody out. Tell everybody to get out here and get going. Thank you, Darian, uh, and make it happen because I, I, I don't know if I can do it or not because every time I put a browser window up on here, it's just kind of like frozen. So I don't know if I can actually do that and put it in the in the live stream. Uh, I might have to put it on the on the TV or something over here, and I don't know, aim the camera at it, but. I'll figure it out and we'll see what happens and I'm going to try to, I'm definitely going to try to live stream during that and it will stop live streaming and then afterwards uh, they will put it on pause and I'll, I'll do something like, uh, maybe something like that and we can, and we can uh, talk about it, chat a little bit. Uh, <clears throat> I guess they call it a react video, but that's not what I'm going to do and, and that's that. And we'll see what happens. But I, I'm really looking forward to it. I think it's gonna be a it's gonna be a fun day, fun morning. And then I'm gonna go back to bed. So let's go, man. So get your friends, get them out there, get your enemies, get whoever, tell them to subscribe. Subscribing is winning. Everything else is bullshit. Whatever it takes, survive by subscribing. <laughs> <laughs> the real line slipped in there. Oh, well. <clears throat> Take two. Whatever it takes, subscribe. That's what I'm talking about. 